So I don't know about you, but Facebook keeps telling me about these crepes. Do they taste any good? I don't know. Let's find out. Roll that intro. So I have seen these crepes. Here's the other ones on Facebook fairly recently. I don't know why they keep telling me about them. Uh, but I happened to find them in my local grocery store, amazingly. So I thought I would pick them up and give them a try. So we have a chocolate hazelnut filled one and a strawberry filled one. Now, uh, the name of the company is Bakerly. They also make, uh, I think, pancakes and uh, bread. I feel like there's something else. There, um, I think there's croissants, croissants that are in like the bread section, but my, my store didn't have any of those. We only had the crepes. So we're going to give them a try. So they are individually wrapped. There are six, I think, and yeah, there's six individually wrapped crepes in each uh, bag. I don't remember how much they are. I will put something up here that will tell you how much they are because I forget. Um, so there's strawberry, chocolate hazelnut. We're gonna try the strawberry one first because I feel like that will be the one that is not my favorite. So they are very thin, like, here's this. They, they feel very thin. Uh, but it's obviously like folded a whole bunch of times. So I don't know. I feel like it's gonna be a weird crepe, but oh, let's give it a try. It's okay. There's not a ton of filling in it, but I feel like it's okay. Like there's just enough to give it a little bit of sweetness without it overpowering the breadiness of the crepe. Um, it does taste like it's just like a, a jam or a jelly that's in there, which I guess is normal. I don't know. I don't eat a lot of crepes, but uh, it's, it's good. I like it. It's much better. It doesn't taste like fake strawberry. It tastes like a real strawberry jam. I'm going to use the word jam. I don't think it's a jelly. I think it's a jam. I don't think it says on here. Um, yeah, it just has the ingredients. It just says strawberry filling actually is what it says. So yeah, it's really good. Um, you know, I don't normally like jams and jellies, so that's why I didn't think that I would like that that much. They're usually a little too sweet for me, but I feel like the crepe part offsets the sweetness, so it actually comes out pretty nice tasting. But let's try, try the chocolate hazelnut one. We I mean, know I like chocolate, so I feel like this one's gonna taste better. All right, uh, looks the same, except it has like a chocolate filling instead. I think I actually like the strawberry one better. Um, I think the the chocolate that in, is in it isn't quite, I don't know how to describe it. I don't know if it's because it's the hazelnut that offsets it, but it's not as chocolatey as what I would like. It, um, I think, actually what I think it is, is there's not enough of the chocolate in there. It is still just like enough to give it like a taste of chocolate in the bread, but it's not enough to really make it chocolatey. So I guess, I guess it's okay. I guess it's kind of setting it off like a Nutella thing in that it's a healthy breakfast. No, it's not, but it's, you know, that kind of thing. But it was good. I would eat it again, but I think I would eat the strawberry one more. Uh, so unfortunately, those are the only two that I have right now because my store didn't have the other stuff. I'll see. 
If you want me to review the other Bakerly items, let me know. I would have to order them online. It's just, it's bread and a croissant and some pancakes. Let me know if you're interested in what I think of them. Leave me a comment. Let me know, have you ever tried these Bakerly products? What do you think about them? Let me know. Then make sure you subscribe so you see all my videos. And uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.